go inside, you never see the stone. Ah. Hope you are okay. Fuck. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Leave it, leave it, please. Let me just help Don't you. touch it. Stupid boy, could not say thank you. Ungrateful so. Hi, babe. What happened? I've been waiting for you. I'm really sorry. I was just trying to help an ungrateful boy like that, eh? I'm Please, sorry. Please, let's go. We're already late. Wait. You didn't even ask for your help? No. It was just run and he stumbled on the stone. I was just trying to be good Samaritan. Hey, good Samaritan. Next time, learn to mind your business. Please, Seriously, let's go, Joe. Seriously, I will. I'm a busybody doing it. Busybody. Yeah. Let's go. The guy is so early this morning. First of all, the name is Jake and not AU. Don't ever call me that again. If you have talked to me this morning, I would have not called you that. So, what are you doing here? I'm not in school. I've been with the market. Of course, we're in school. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Bro, he's a new student. Isn't that obvious? Have you ever seen? Any guy as handsome as him in this group? No. But you should have been so nice to him. Eh? But don't worry. I apologize to him on your behalf. Yes, you don't need to. What are friends for? I mean, come, John. Let's go. Please. Good morning, students. Good morning, sir. Yes. Before you go into your classroom, hmm, I would like you to know that the beautiful environment we have here is not free. Hmm? Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. This beautiful building is not free. Do you understand me? The furniture you use in the classroom, hmm? not free. Hmm? The teachers that teach you in the classroom, they need their salaries. True or false? But if you are teachers and you work at the end of the month, your salary is not paid. How will you feel? Will you feel good? Good. What I'm saying, in effect, is that to run this school, eh, we need money. What do I say? We need money. And the money is coming from no other place other than your school fees. You understand that? Yes, sir. So, those of you who have not paid up your school fees, you need to pay up. Is that clear? Yes, sir. You tell your parents that, Within the next seven days, hmm, any student that has not paid up will be stopped from coming to school until such a student pays his or her fees in full. Is that clear? Yes, sir. That is clear. Yes, sir. It's all right. Uh, you and you, 
two of you meet me in the office. Mind them in the classroom. from you again. See, the burden of this school eh, is resting upon your shoulders now. Hmm? We are having an intercontinental competition coming up. Hmm? We've been doing such before and we'll be coming at tops. This time, not only do we want to come at tops, Mm? But we want to come out as, as the best. And I, the, the whole of the school, eh, have so much confidence in the two of you. Your brilliance, your excellence, your ability to perform better than other students. The school so much believe that the two of you have what it takes to take the name of this school to greater heights. Therefore, you are both be chosen to represent our school in the forthcoming intercontinental competition. Is that left? Yes, sir. Before you leave for the competition, if there is any other information, eh? I will pass it over to you. Is that clear? Yes, sir. So in advance, I tell you congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Just as I was saying, as the head boy of this school, you have so much responsibilities, just like the teachers in the, in the classroom. Hmm? You are not expecting the, the control of the other students. Eh? will be left into the hands of the teachers. You understand? Okay. So as the head boy, it is your responsibility to make sure that the students eh, do not wander around the school premises eh, anyhow. Okay. Mm? Okay. You ensure that every student is in the classroom when it is nine for them to be in the classroom. Okay. Mm? It is also your responsibility to make sure that the environment, hmm, the environment is, is always kept neat by the students. You understand that? Good. When you see any of the students eh, that is doing what is not expected of any student, it is your responsibility to stop that student from doing so. And where that student disobeys, what's going to Office. Is that left? Like? Yes, sir. As yeah. rightly said, you know, no matter how you talk to some students, they are very stubborn, they never listen. But I want to assure you that from that effort, they are going to feel great with you. Thank you very much. God bless you as you do that. Thank you, sir. Yes. Delighted having you as my students too. Good afternoon. Yes. See that. Ah, uh, you know it is not easy to create a new product. Stanford Academy is the product that everyone wants to associate with. Stanford Academy has become like. Sugar and the ant. 
Wherever you drop sugar, no matter how small, the ant will locate it. We have become that product that everyone wants to be associated with. We are increasing. And it is not just by because we answer the name, but because we are good in all that we do. And therefore, I we have here another student who has come to join you. And uh, Let's see. You. Take a She's a beautiful lady like so many of you here. Is that not true? Yes, sir. No. I don't need to appeal to you. She's one of you already. So you accept her as one of you. Treat her as one of you. And then. If there's any work that we have done before, which I believe there yeah. are, let her have it. Hmm? Whatever class work we have done, give it to her. Whatever work we have done in this class before, let her have it. So that she can as well become as good as we are. Are we not good? Yes, sir. We are good. So, be her friend and not her enemy. Will you be her enemy? No, sir. But you will be her what? Her friend. Good. And uh, at this point, I will want all of you to tell her well to Stanford Academy. Welcome to Stanford Academy. That's good. So, I shall take leave of you. Why interrupt her? Have a wonderful time. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Hi, Jake. Hi. Well, I know you don't know me. But relax, I don't buy it. Okay. My name is Rose. And I was with Hi, Jake. I know I don't have to do any introduction anymore because I know you remember me. Anyways, I got this for you. Wait, wait. What's going on here? What are you guys trying to do? I'm just here to apologize for being rude to you the other day. I thought I told you not to bother. That I was going to help you out. Did I ask you to do this for me? Did I? You don't need to ask for my help. What are friends for? I never told you I couldn't face dig myself. So it's not in your place to do this. Place? Since when did we start having a place? Am I not your friend? We've been doing things together. We do things for each other. So how come this is different? I know we are friends, but it's still not in your place. I told you I was going to do this in person. <laughs> okay. Are you guys done? Are you guys done? <laughs> See, I don't know what's going on here. I don't know what you guys are trying to do for this game you are playing. See, let me tell you, I'm not in for this. I'm, I'm not in for this at all at all. See. This thing you brought for me is the least of my problems. I don't need them. I don't need them at all. And if you want me to accept your apology, then give me money. Eh? So, if you can give me money, yes, I will forgive you. Not this, I'm sorry. If you don't have it, uh, back off. See if you can ever afford it. Wait, 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 wait. There's no money you want. Yes. Sick. Wow. Hope you're happy now. You are serious? Hope you are okay. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> Wait, let me see how much she gets you. Is that a business? 
That thing she gives to you, don't worry. Have money. It's not money you want. I'll give you money. All I just need is for you to be my boyfriend. See, I have something here. Let me give it to you. Tomorrow I'll bring more for you. Okay. Just be nice to me. Be my boyfriend. That's all I want. And I'll take care of you. Hmm? All right. Take care of yourself. I will. Tomorrow I'll see you. Bye. <laughs> It's your film. These guys are not serious. <laughs> me your father's compound. Claron, I'm here to warn you. How dare you? How dare you embarrass me in front of Jake? Wait, how are you even my friend when you can't read me? Read your ass now, eh? Read your ass, read your textbook or biology textbook. Tell me. You can fool around as much as you want. Stay away from Jake. I like that guy. If you try to jump out, that is my chance with him. I will make sure I deal with you, forgetting the fact that you're my friend. Wait, how did we even become friends in the first place? The way you are behaving now, this is how friends behave. Just because of a guy you barely know, you are here rolling like a wounded lioness whose cup will swallow you. I so much like the fact that you acknowledge it that I am a lioness. Let me warn you. Stay away from Jake. Hells, how did you drop shoot for nothing, girl? I can't believe this coming from someone I call my friend. Just because of a guy she barely knows. For this drama she jokes at head, I must go out with Jake. If she can throw away her friendship to the wind, just because of a boy she barely knows. So, the friendship isn't worth saving. Who we'll just cut out everything? No sense. I don't seem to understand what these guys are doing. They are supposed to be friends, but it looks like the relationship will break because of me. Who cares if it breaks? As long as I get what I want from both of them, I will just play along and make sure I dream them of every resources that will be useful to me. <laughs> yes. Jake! Jake! Sir, I'm coming. Stop with the drama now. We're not talking to you now. Honestly, I'm not hurting. I'm surprised you called me that. Well, I I don't want to say I'm sorry about my attitude already. I was a bit confused and surprised about you and your friends' attitude. That's right. Stop that. She's not my friend. Stop for me. She can never be my friend. How do you mean? Claren does not value our friendship. Over the years, we've been friends. She doesn't still know me well. I don't see any sense 
in apologizing to her for the wrong she has made. Because I wasn't asked to do that. A smart friend is supposed to know that our friend is trying to go close to that guy in question. I understand, but it's really wise for you to discuss things with her. Uh, so that you both go on the same page before making a move. You will find it strange for me to fall in love with a guy I barely know. Well, I hope you guys set yourself out. But I appreciate you liking me, but I don't think I can reciprocate the feeling. But why? Just that I have many things on my head and I don't think I have time for romance. What is it? Anything, what do you want? Ah. I can do anything for you. Ah, calm down now. No, I can't calm down. I really like you and I want you to be my boyfriend, please. Just that right now, uh, I have some financial problems and I really need the sum of 2,000 euro. And if you really like my claim, don't mind you giving it to me. Money? Yes. I'll give you a little bit. Okay. This is what I have. Just take this. Tomorrow I'll balance it for you. I didn't really come out with a lot. I'll give you more. Yeah. You expect it's pretty take me serious. But thank you anyway. Anything thank you. for you now. Yeah. It's like you're entering my eyes now. <laughs> I like what I see. But one thing do. Don't tell your friend Claron about this. Take Claron. Go for me. I won't say anything. Okay, let's go now. What's up? Um, I was almost coming to your house. I thought you were not coming. Oh, I'm sorry for keeping you waiting. But seriously, don't come to my house. I don't understand. Is it because of rules? No, no. Just that you are not welcome. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it that way. But I don't like you to come to my house when invited as well. It's not as if I don't like you. No. Does that mean you like me? If I like you. I think that's the answer. Anyway, can we go to school now? Yes. Wow, you look beautiful this morning. Thank you. Yes, you look good, child. Thank you. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, what do you want me to do? Um, it's a surprise. Oh, I can't wait for the surprise. I love surprises. I've been waiting for you out here. What are you doing outside? I just said... I just said I've been waiting for you out here. Where is it? Let me have it. Have what? I said let me... I no, said... Don't, don't come close. Don't come close. I'll give you. I'll give you. Don't come close. Let me have it. Take it. Why is it that you detest me so much? You yourself. Do you like yourself? Yeah? But I told you stop smoking them. Now stop smoking, you know. Yeah. You smoke them all day. You need to see you smoke. You are killing yourself, but now look at it like you are killing yourself now. Look like a madman, but I stop smoking, you know. Yeah. Are you calling your head about a madman? Jinx, where are you going to? But I, I'm leaving so that later on, not gonna beat me. 
But I see I'm a normal day. I can rush you, but I, I but I change you, but I change. Where is the money I kept in my room? In my wardrobe, 25,000 naira. Money. I, Auntie Mommy, please, eh? Please, just try and forgive and forget, please. I should try and do what? Forgive so you show me. What is wrong with you? Where is the money I kept in my room? Every day in this life, I give you money to school, you eat before leaving this house. So what do you want me to do? Auntie Mommy, please. Please, you know I'm your only sister. Only sister what? Because you are my only sister, so you have to steal from me. What did you use the money for? It's money. <laughs> Start talking! I give it... I give it to a boy in my school. You said what? I give it to a boy in my school! You give it to me! 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 I'm really sorry. I was foolish. I'm sorry too. I shouldn't have thrown our friendship away just because of someone I barely knew. Can you imagine? I even stole my auntie's money just to get Jay's attention. I never knew he was a drug addict. He isn't. His brother is. So why was he arrested? He was arrested because he was caught in the act. I saw two men chasing him when I was on my way to his house. So he would have been a good person if not for his brother. Please, I don't want anything to come in between us anymore. Let's keep this friendship, please. And I promise we'll value this friendship like our lives. Mm -hmm. 